Thank you. For, yeah, first of all, to answer the question, there's no such thing as collective takfir in Islam. You can't make, uh, you cannot say all this group are non-Muslims. Yeah, takfir is done on individuals. And, and, and there's a trial, there's a whole process, you know, they're asked questions. So, so the idea of saying people are kafir is totally against the Islamic tradition, first and foremost. Secondly. So, so, Hamza, for those of us who are on the outside, would that be like excommunication? Excommunication, oh, okay, yeah. Gotcha. So, so in terms of the Ahmadiyya problem in Pakistan, it's a political problem. We know that, right? Because the Ismailis, who are very powerful in Pakistan, right, <laughs> who don't pray generally, right, and, 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 and have been anathematized traditionally, uh, you know, by, by the Muslims, they're not persecuted in Pakistan because they have very high, powerful positions. And so, again, we get back to it's all politics. And, you know, as Bob Dylan said, we're living in a political world, you know, so that's a problem, right? So I, I, I feel like, you know, I'm against religious persecution. I think there's a reason why for the first 13 years Muslims were persecuted. You know, so they could know and understand what it's like to be persecuted. 